sometimes the Lord is saying, I want my children to worship me. The Lord says, my children are not worshiping me. They don't come to spend time in front of my throne, says the Lord. And the Lord says, that's why my children are missing out on so much of my glory. The Lord says, my children are missing out what I have prepared for them. The Lord says, I have so much more prepared for my children. The Lord says, they don't understand my love. They are not able to receive my love because they think so small. The Lord says, they think so small of me. The Lord says, they think so small that they don't want me and don't allow me to enlarge the space in their heart to make them able to contain more of my love. Yes. The Lord says, I want you to know that I have so much more in store for you. I have so much more in store for you, says the Lord. The Lord says, but I cannot put new wine in old skins. They will not be able to contain it. They will burst. The Lord says, but in this end time, I want to give you a new wineskin, a new heart. The Lord says, I want to take you to my throne room. I want to take to, you to my place, to the holy of holiest. The Lord says, I want to show you my glory. I show, want to show you more than I have ever shown before. The Lord says, I want you to come before me and I want you to worship me. And the Lord says, as you worship me, I will start sanctifying you. The Lord says, I will start cleaning and cleansing you. I will start dealing with the sins and the issues of your life. The Lord says, I will start removing the detestable things that you have placed before me. I will start removing the things that spoil the, the, your life, that spoils your holiness, that spoils my temple. Your body is the temple of the Holy Spirit, says the Lord. Your body is my holy temple and it shall no longer be defiled. And I will remove the detestable things, says the Lord. And I will bring my holiness in new measures, in new ways as you have never seen before. The Lord says, I want you to come before my throne. I want to fill you with my glory because I want to know you that you are my children. And I love you, says the Lord. I love you, says the Lord. And I want you to know. I want you to know that I love you. I have died for you, says the Lord Jesus. And find the Lord God, our Father says, I sent my son. Don't you understand? I sent my son to the earth for you. And he died for you because I love you. I created you in my own image, says the Lord. You are in my own image, says the Lord. Come before my throne, says the Lord, and I will sanctify you. I will restore your brokenness. I will restore you, says the Lord. I will restore you back to the place from which you have fallen. Don't you know where you have fallen from? Allow me to restore you, says the Lord. Allow me to restore you, says the Lord God Almighty. He says, I want to restore you and bring you back to me so that you will feel my heartbeat. The Lord says, I want you to feel my heartbeat. And your worries, your concerns, your agonies, the Lord says, they will wash away because the blood of my son Jesus was shed for that. The Lord says, when they pierced him with that spear and his blood was rushing out and fell on the earth, that blood washed away your sin. When they whipped him and tore open his back and his blood was flushing out, the Lord says, your agonies were flushed away because he bore your agonies and your pains. You do not, you are not supposed to carry those things. They do not belong to you. And the Lord says, when you say, 
Why am I in pain? Why am I in agony? The Lord says, you are in agony because you have not brought it to me. You have not come before my throne. You have not spent time with me. The Lord says, I have not created any place in your life for agony. There is no container, there is no storage for agony in your life. Because it's not supposed to be there. And the Lord says, that's why my son Jesus came. Come before my throne, says the Lord. There is a new wine. There are new measures of my love and my grace. But the Lord says, I want you to come before my throne. Come before my throne. Seek my face. And I will pour out my spirit upon you. And the things that will happen. You will never have dreamt of ever before. Come before my throne, says the Lord. For I love you. You are my child. I love you, says the Lord. Come before my throne. And you will receive a new life. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name.